Now, of course, today marks the anniversary on Xantiar of the great drilling mission to defeat the evil dwellers of the inner core. And our correspondent, Jojel Fufulkwai, is there. It's a big occasion, isn't it, for the Xantarians? Very much so. We're just about to see the ruler Splendursula emerge from the halls of Yanthrakar wearing an advanced Humuvian gown, which is connected to a floating life drone by a pipe which sustains her energy force. You can just about make it out there as she emerges from the halls of Yanthrakar. And uh, any moment now, we will be hearing the Xantarian fanfare played by Splendursula's avant guardsman. And here she is, the energy pipe from her floating life drone clearly visible now. Beside her sits Sublord Utilax, who is wearing his ceremonial symbiote Ronjons. And uh, Splendursula, of course, has required the life drone ever since the unsuccessful attack on her life by the Kiltrons last Yaren. And now we go to the parade ground of Lukox, where a living sacrifice will be made to the underground garage beast of Xantiar in return for the Great Drill, which lies there in storage. And looking on, as the underground garage beast retrieves the great drill, are the Xantarian guard. And just like Sublord Utilax, each guard wears his own unique symbiote. The symbiotes, of course, keep the heads of the guards snug and warm, and in return, they suck their brains. And here is the Great Drill, which burrowed down to the centre of the planet to defeat the evil core dwellers, and one of those who used his mechanical morphing powers to transform himself into part of this device was Super Commander Deck Laser, who we spoke to earlier today. As I've said on previous occasions, I was only a small cog uh, in this very large machine. When there were 27,000 of us that went down uh, in total, uh, 8,000 miles, uh, which was an extraordinary feat of achievement. 